In this lesson, we're going to look at a special string function in Java, split, which can be used to take a string and divide it up based on a regular expression and put the constituent parts of the string into a array. For example, let's say you had a comma delimited file. You could use the split function and break up each part of that file or each line based on the strings that come before and after the commas so that each string that came before and after a comma was placed into its own element of an array. Now in this particular example we're going to look at how we would split a file that is marked up with HTML tags. So what I'm going to do is create a very simple HTML file. It's not even going to be correct HTML just to give you an idea of how this split function works. So let me create the file first. And that's all it's going to be. We have a bold tag and an italics tag. And we want to break up the string based on those tags. So let's exit and save the file. Now we're going to create a Java program to do that. We're going to call it strip tags.java. Now I'm going to type for just a minute while I get the program started. All right, at this point, I've written the code that we need to read the lines of text into our program and store them in a single variable. There are, of course, ways to do that using one function call, but I chose to do it in kind of the old programming one style. Now, the next step is to go ahead and call the split function. So the string that holds all of our text is lines. I realize our file only has one line, but it would work with any file. So you could have a really true HTML document and then be able to split up the text on tags using this program. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a string array. We'll call it stripped. And then we call the split function or the split method. Now here all we have to do is provide a regular expression. And what we're going to do is, is we're going to write a regular expression so that it looks for not only tags but also embedded tags. Like that. And then we'll have it do a greedy match to find as many as it can. And then we'll close off the function. Well, that's all we'll have to do and the function, the split function, will then operate on this regular expression and take the results and store it in our array variable. Now let's simply loop through the array variable and display the results. Close everything off and we're ready to go. So we'll save the file. Go back to our command prompt, compile, and then run it. And there's our results. Now is the time with the tags removed. Go back and look at the program again very quickly. And it's a very simple process. We simply need to call the function split with a regular expression, depending on what you're trying to do. For a comma delimited file, you just have to specify the comma. So a lot of times people use the split function without even realizing that they're writing a regular expression to have the function perform. And then it will store its results in an array. So that wraps up this lesson on using split with Java in order to break up a string based on a regular expression.